Okay, so two months ago, I got the craziest plant mail. It was a variegated fry deck. I had it acclimating inside my greenhouse cabinet and now it's time to repot it. I feel like even a few months ago, these were impossible to find. So the fact that they're available, oh my God, that's a corm. Pick up corms is a backup plant because you can grow a whole new plant with I it. I got two plants in one. So this was grown inside a sponge plug. This isn't bad in and of itself and oh my God, that's another corm. I'm definitely gonna plant that later. Okay, so back to this sponge plug. It's a special plug used by the grower to promote healthy root growth. I still prefer to remove it, but it took forever and I got cross-eyed by the end of it. Look at those healthy roots. I definitely don't want the plant to go into shock, so I'm sprinkling in some root crack. You don't need to remove the plug, but I personally struggle with the sponge having a different moisture level from the rest of the soil. Now it's potted into a chunky mix sprinkled with some healthy bacteria and fungi. Back into the greenhouse it goes because this princess requires high humidity. And let's take a look a week later. So far, so good. I'm gonna lose the oldest leaf, but that's normal. Now, as for this corn, I've never been so excited to be a grandma. To root this, I'm using this aquarium substrate and I have a 100% success rate with it. Even with a grow light and a heat mat. This will take 10 years.